Hello, and welcome to Red Letter Media's Haunted Museum. We've collected many haunted objects from around the globby. Haunted objects like haunted dolls, haunted clocks, haunted dolls, haunted goblets, haunted bird cages, haunted, haunted dolls, dolls, haunted teapots, haunted dolls, haunted objects from around the world. Mike, what have you done to my living room? Welcome. Did, did you cut holes in my walls? What do you think of the haunted museum, Rich? What do you think of this sign I made? Pretty great, huh? I worked really hard on you it. You worked really hard on that sign. Yeah, yeah. you sure did, Mike. Yeah, you should work very I mean, hard on that sign. You're surprised by the living room transformation, so... You, you've got me at a, <laughs> at a place where I can't say that I made the sign, because of course I didn't make the sign no. because I walked in here and I'm completely surprised exactly. by what you did to what is my living room. Exactly. Yeah, And yeah. I made a pretty awesome sign, if I say so myself. <laughs> Let's move past the sign and discuss the fact that I filled your living room with haunted items from around the world. In fact, I have a special section called Real Haunted Items of items that I've purchased on eBay by sellers who claim that they're haunted. And I put them in their special section right over there, as you can see. But wait, if those are the real haunted items, what is, what is everything else? Anyway, why don't you tell us about our very first uh, haunted item. Ooh. Why, it's Tim Ritter's killing spree. Just stop it! A killing spree. They're all dead. Or are they? Oh shit. This is very small print. Do you need haunted people? Uh, hold on, let me. This is embarrassing. Mm -hmm. Newly wed Tom Abestus Felt? <laughs> Russo suspects his hot wife Lisa Courtney Lorca from Slaughterhouse is having sexual encounters with their suburban neighbors and why don't we watch Tim Ritter's Killing Spree? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's spooky! <laughs> you ready to talk about our next haunted item, Tim? I guess so, man. I'm freaking out. Here it is. Ooh. Night of the Demon. Foot covers. The first real Bigfoot gore fest. The Sasquatch Splatter Masterwork restored uncut for the first time ever. Oh my God. Oh my God. This I'm is excited. Big news. This I'm excited. Is big news. Amid the gush of early 80s low budget backwoods horror, <laughs> only one lost classic. It's a string of words I just don't like. I'm sorry. What? I'm gush sorry. and backwoods? The backwards? 80s low budget backwoods horror. <laughs> gush. That's the worst collection of words in a sentence. That I could possibly imagine, but continue. The 80s were a magical time. Oh, God. Oh, I didn't even, I, there wasn't even a period yet. <laughs> I'm gonna just start this over. Amid the gush of early 80s low budget backwoods horror, only one lost classic brought together softcore sex, hardcore violence, 
satanic sex cults, and limb-tearing, gut-slinging, dick-ripping beast for the best and bloodiest Bigfoot movie ever made. Well, that's quite a bunch of alliteration there. When a group of anthropology students head deep into the forest to investigate a series of Sasquatch attacks. Wait, shut up. That ceramic chicken just moved. I swear, did you guys catch that on camera? Did, ah! you, did you catch that on camera? The ceramic chicken dar just moved dead. Anyways, continue. When a group of anthropology students head deep into the forest to investigate a series of Sasquatch attacks, they'll discover an immortal brain blast of crazy hermits, mutilated Girl Scouts, interspecies copulation, and one of the goriest final scenes in the whole history of splatter flicks. Wait, so this has a Bigfoot in it, and yep. has the term interspecies copulation, um, which uh, followed Girl Scouts. I just, yeah. I'm, I'm just bracing for every possible. Yeah. Oh, oh! Did you catch that on camera? What is it, what is it, what moved? This old water jug, which says fear God and fear not, just flung itself off of this wooden shelf. If this isn't proof of the paranormal, I don't know what is. It just fell again. Ready to tell us about our third haunted item, Jay? Uh, after Night of the Demon, I just don't know how much more of the, the terror I can handle. Are you ready? Cause here it is. I can't see it. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's Vampire Riders with a Z. Starring Marina Sirtis. Starring. She is of course famous from Star Wars. Star Wars. <laughs> Classic bait and switch, haunted bait and switch. Haunted bait and switch. Haunted this is a haunted Number episode. It's full of spookiness and, and bait and switches. Switch, haunted and haunted. Haunted. Uh, Sticky Fingers is also in the film. Oh. Mm -hmm. Genre, urban thriller. I never would have guessed by the Z on the end of the name. Mm. As we know from previous experience, any horror film that Pias. replaces its S with a Z is the mark of equality. Right. Uh, I'm a werewolf. Bitch. The world is in chaos and vampires rule the streets. Every five centuries, an ancient sacrificial ritual involving the slain of the Daywalker maintains the vampire lord's immortality. As vampires roam the streets searching for the Daywalker, two vampire hunters must try to stop them. What is this about a prostitute? What? Vampire Riders! I'm, I'm scared. scared! Oh! Oh! No. oh, oh my God. God. Almost. Did you see him? He tried. He thought about trying to catch it. Yeah, yeah. He tried to catch it. That was great. They just left it in the movie. They're like, "This is real." The bartender's like, "Oh no, my shot class. I let you film here for free." <laughs> Oh, wow. <laughs> that looked really good. <laughs> Did you see my grandson's movie? <laughs> that looked really good. You know, you know, Mike, not, not too- Bye now. Huh? Oh, are we starting with the Ouija board? Well, sure. We're starting with, the, all right. Now, are we supposed to put full weight? I thought just no. like- Two just, fingers no, though. Yeah, two, fingers. two fingers, you barely oh. touch it. Okay, now you barely touch it. Okay, spirits <laughs> of beyond. I'm what? not moving it. I'm not moving it. I'm not moving it either. What? Spirits from beyond, we call upon you. Oh no, it stopped stop moving. Stop doing that. What? Stop doing what? I'm not doing anything. You're, you're, you're cheating. You're, 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 cheating. We can tell you're putting tons of pressure. Let, very, light very, very lightly. Very lightly. Very lightly. See how my okay. fingers are I, being lifted up? That's bullshit. Okay, listen. All three of you shut up. Okay. Spirits from beyond. Be louder, more nasally. We welcome you. 
into our studio to indulge in this conversation of three terrible movies that we watched on tonight's episode of Best of the Worst. We welcome all, especially violent, violent, deadly demons to attach themselves to Rich Evans <laughs> and attach him with a dark haunting and a dark presence that will follow him the rest of his life. We, we cast you off. Short, short life. Short life. <laughs> We cast you off, uh, Jay, Mike, and Tim will go home without any demonic attachments. Whoa, 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 whoa. You don't want He's this. driving me home. Oh. Oh. Attached to Rich after he drops Tim off. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Gotta be more you. specific. Yeah, uh, then, uh, d uh, d what, what do you say, yes or no to this? Oh, he said yes. Thank oh, God. Went, went, God, he said yes. Oh, it went right to yes. To yes. Uh, that's a, that's just weird. Some spookiness. Okay, Rich, I'm so sorry. Uh -huh, uh -huh. If you want to like just go where I'm going, Rich, uh, you're more than welcome to, and no demons. Because if oh, I stay went, with Rich, it went to goodbye. You gotta close it. That's true. We didn't. I guess we, we have a whole we have and a whole it's discussion, off the, it's and off then the we can board, close it so. when we're done. Okay, we we'll close it when we're done. All right. Broke, All right. So. So, well, that was that was some that was spooky. We, Super we, natural. We played with a Ouija board in our studio. This is bad. It's a, it's a bad thing. It's bad because we do have legitimate haunted items. We do. Yes, it's over there in our haunted museum in the section of real haunted items. Like I think the Ouija board we bought at the freaking Spirit Halloween is the least of our troubles. Oh, Jay <laughs> bought this at Target. <laughs> That's much more haunted than the Spirit Halloween. No, Walmart. That's where you go if you want the really haunted items. That's when you really want to get scared. You go to Walmart. Yeah. No, but, uh, okay, so over there, we have a special camera, a night vision camera set up during this discussion to capture any paranormal activity that may happen in our real haunted items display over there. I, I want to I emphasize, those are the real haunted items. Yes. Not the fake haunted items that I just quickly bought at a thrift store they before could be we haunted. Filmed. That's the thing, though. We don't know. That's true. That's true. We don't know their history. We know the history of these items. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, when Allegedly. I Allegedly. Wh what? What? Now, did he get what? these at stores or did he get them at thrift shops? Because I doubt thrift shops vet their right their exactly so your items could items. be more haunted than those it's, it's those entirely i got so someone just didn't sell old junk on ebay for like 70 to 100 dollars each <laughs> as a scam <laughs> well, well how much did you pay for that shit don't worry about it don't worry about it you also had them uh in a separate room where you recorded them i did i did a, i did an experiment where i ran a camera for 24 hours non-stop and I used a spirit box, an SB7 spirit box, which was gifted to me by Macaulay Culkin, mm -hmm. famous star of such films as Richie Rich. Speak to us, haunted items. Haunted items. Speak to us. Speak to me, haunted item. Speak to me. And and I, I attempted a spirit box communication with the haunted items. I received no responses. But when I recorded the items on camera for 24 hours, I also saw no activity. What if, what if we're having a discussion of a uh, killing spree and in the middle of it, uh, one of those items just flies right off the fucking shelf? Now see, here's the thing. With that kind of tone and that kind of sarcasm. That's not sarcasm, not what happen. if that happens? It's not gonna happen. That's what I'm saying is when it does. We have oh, not rigged does. any any fishing wire or anything. To, when that's it does happen, no yeah. one will believe us. <laughs> that's true. It's the boy who cried haunted clown. It's a classic <laughs> tale of, of cautionary tale. Yeah. God damn it, Rich. See, that's the thing. We joke around so much about this stuff, and we'll probably rig up a fishing wire to make the teddy bear fly off the shelf. Then it's really going to happen, and we're all going to be fucking shitting our pants. Yeah. And then no one in the universe will believe us. Not even Zack Snyder would believe us because he made those spooky Batman films. Do you guys promise? <laughs> How long, it took you like a few seconds to think of a different Zach, didn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Do you, you promise to shit your pants? 
I promise to shoot my pants. Yes. I mean, make... that's probably going to happen anyway. Okay. Look, look. I, all I can tell you is it's an Hold experiment. On. Uh oh. What happened? Yeah. Fell all upside down. Oh. Oh lord. It's not, you have it connected to your. I know. Dangly thing. Okay, hang on. Connected to the he shirt. That's what Rich did. Okay. Look. All, all I know Wait. is. Wait. <laughs> Try one more time. Okay. All wait, I wait, know, wait, 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 hold on. I know. Is it, does it, is it? Tuck just trying to make sure. In the string. Okay. okay. Tell me if it moves. Okay. okay. All right. Now, all I. Oh, you didn't give me time. You didn't pause. <laughs> I'm going to do it again. Okay. <laughs> and ready, Rich? Uh-huh. I'm ready. Three, two. Now, all I know is that. Well, let's talk about Tim Ritter's killing spree. And I'm done talking about Tim Ritter's killing hey, spree. Hey, it all was right. actually, yeah. I think all three of these movies nah. were all right. Okay, well, I'm gonna talk about Tim Ritter's killing spree. The softest heads <laughs> in <Yeah>. Hollywood. <laughs> Oh, Jesus, this is tiny. <laughs> <laughs> Newlyweds, newlywed Tom, uh, the AKA the whole crazy looking homeless guy. Yeah. Oh, who, yeah, we didn't realize his name until like. Asbestos feet. Asbestos feet. <laughs> felt. The, it's felt. <laughs> yeah. The font that they used had the. Uh, what oh, the, what yeah. is it called? Um, Kerning? Kerning? Kernel, kerneling, kerning? kerning or the other one, one of the two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, where the, all the letters are smashed together, so it looked like asbestos feet. But his name is asbestos felt. Mm -hmm. His parents loved him. <laughs> his hot wife Lisa Courtney Lacara from Slaughterhouse oh. is having sexual encounters with their suburban neighbors and visitors. I was taking a shower, in case you didn't notice. <laughs> Uh, Tom retaliates by launching a methodical and inventive campaign to murder the lovers, utilizing such unexpected devices as a, quote, killer ceiling fan, <laughs> a TV set. Yeah. He, yeah, remember he connected his intestines yeah. to the yeah. TV set? Yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, an ordinary screwdriver. a hammer, and a lawnmower. But Tom's victims don't lie buried peacefully in his backyard. Oh, I'm glad they didn't tell us this because it's a big spoiler. They're coming back from the dead for revenge. Yeah, that was the most exciting part of the movie. Thank God for poor eyesight. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. <laughs> we would have we would have been like, wait, I mean, when's this? Oh, who, I'll, who put this on? Is this Terror Vision? Uh, I think it's a Terror yes, Vision. Yes, it is Terror Vision. Terror Vision. Yeah. Make your fonts bigger, specifically for us. Oh, do like Tom a fucking like footloose dance. <laughs> Angry dancing. There's <laughs> uh. <clears throat> hidden door. Oh my oh. god! Oh. Oh. <laughs> that is a punch. Fuck that guy. <laughs> Jesus. What a strange place to have a killing spree. Yeah. <laughs> the water awkwardly. That guy didn't even do anything. The other guy at least bumped into him. Was he dead? dead. Uh, he, he just, yeah, he just drowned him. Wow. In front of all those people. Yep. I mean, it was a perfect, perfect representation on a journey into madness. Mm. Asbestos, like, really went into dark places. I mean, Asbestos Felt, a.k.a. Tom, was kind of crazy from the get-go. There was only, like, one scene. Remember his neighbor, uh, uh, Tom... Uh, Bosley? No, Tom that's his friend. That's his, his, oh, six, that's his, his best friend. His 65-year-old best friend. Hey, what's going on here? Nothing. Why? Hey, we're talking about old times. Yeah, I'll bet. I can't even leave my wife alone for two minutes with my best friend. Get out of here. Well, that's his best oh friend. Oh, God. <laughs> that says a lot about Remember him. Remember when you were six and I was 22? <laughs> Boy, it's <laughs> been a great the good old days. You clearly overstayed your welcome, pal. Now get lost. 
Remember when I groomed you? I was your barber for 16 years. Asbestos Feet like, is a maintenance guy who specifically works in the letters on the sides of the planes. Because the place that owns all the planes won't let him fucking touch any component of an airplane. Mm -hmm. Just in case. He's checking the letters on the plane. <laughs> yep, still letters. That's a structural G. <laughs> But they're best friends, and he invites his best friend over for dinner. And his best friend starts hitting on his hot wife, Lisa. Well, he doesn't really start hitting on her, though. That's the confusion of the whole movie. That's what starts his killing spree. That's what starts his killing spree, is that he is so uh, uh, like jealous and paranoid that he thinks everybody is trying to fuck his wife. So he leaves the room for one second and comes back in, and his elderly friend is just talking with Lisa and he just assumes the worst. Was it meant to be obvious, or did they just screw up and make it too obvious on accident what was going on? Stop it! <laughs> <laughs> He's radioactive. You stupid ass, you. I need more than one man, Tom. I need hundreds to satisfy me. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. What? Whoa! Oh, Seymour. Oh, she's... Yeah. Look at this oh, weird what? surrealness. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, this is the worst oh, thing I've ever seen. God. Oh, he's got to be embarrassed. <laughs> it was only like three seconds. <laughs> Remember that time Grandpa was in a movie? Did you want to see it? <laughs> uh, but they establish uh, that his wife reads like trashy short love stories in a magazine. So they set that up at the beginning and then he discovers her diary and it has all these like stories of, of love affairs. Uh, and so we knew immediately what was going on but then the movie goes on for another hour and a half before we discover the twist that, oh, she's not really sleeping with these people. It's just stories that she's written. It's all an excuse for some relatively uncreative kills. Yeah, it's, well, it's not so much the creativity that's the problem, it's the, like, the pacing. Oh wait, he's building a specialized weapon. Oh my lord. Nice. Oh, is. oh my god. Oh, he's gonna. The decapitated with a fan. So if you have wrong anybody with the ceiling super fan. tall. Oh, he's gonna have the electrician come over and look at the ceiling fan. And and he's gonna chop off his head. He won't notice that half of the ceiling fan blade is a machete. <laughs> <laughs> All of them. All are. of them. Oh. What the fuck? Like everything is so slowly set up, and Basing then after he kills them, yeah, yeah, it's so slow. Like the idea, the uh, he has an electrician comes over. And he has this fantasy about his wife sleeping with the electrician in a little tiny children's bed. Um, so then he fixes the, he invites the electrician over again the next day, but he fixes uh, machetes to each of the ceiling fan blades. And we're like, well, how's this gonna work? Funny, I've never seen fan blades like these before. They were different yesterday when I was stopping your wife. <laughs> stopping. He's just gonna pick him up. I knew it. I can't believe it was that stupid. Oh, it was oh. just the top off. He dawn of the dead at him. Yeah. <laughs> that was really complicated. <laughs> just hack him with the blade when he's not looking. We thought, I thought, because he worked on airplanes, I think I was in the mindset of an, like a propeller. Oh, sure. I'm like, okay. He's gonna flip the switch, you know, when the guy's up there like futzing around with the yeah. fan and then it's gonna start turning. And then he's gonna go, oh, you know, <laughs> I, so it doesn't I, make sense, but. It I was, thought it would be less logical that he was gonna lock him like in the room and then turn the fan on and it was gonna start slowly coming down. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah. That's when the guy just leans against the wall. Out. And can't get yeah. Him. Yeah, yeah, but oh, then yeah, it's like extend. He would have had to, yeah, it would have like, been very clever be... for him to, yeah. Or, or like, yeah, the fan looks like a normal fan and then the, the blades fall off and then real blades come out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're thinking in fantasy land. This isn't that kind of movie. But then uh, he just lifts the guy up. Yeah, he awkwardly grabs him and picks him up. Mm -hmm. And we talked like the fan blade motor is not strong enough to, to cut the top of someone's skull off. 
no matter how sharp the blade is. I can forgive that if it was like an exciting, fun, goofy it's, scene. It was so But it's just bad. so weirdly executed. It's such a convoluted, stupid way to kill someone. Yeah. And it, it doesn't fit with the title of a killing spree. A killing spree is like, like violent and, you know. Non-stop. Gar garbage day. Garbage day? Huh? No! And Not, go and yeah. go. Yeah, yeah, that's a killing that's spree. That's a killing spree. The end of Silent Night, Deadly Night 2. And they try to do creative lighting with this, where it's like when we enter his sort of fantasy world, red light blasts from, from somewhere. I don't know. I think it's like a creep show influence. I felt a little creep show with the music Ugh. in parts. Why did the dude, why did Asbestos Feet have such a low, uh, like, self, like, uh, what's it? What's well, he it looks called? like the Unabomber. True, so. true. But, like, when you are reading something of fantasy of supposedly your wife... Uh, uh, fucking around with other people, he would, I, if I was in his jealous, crazy, like, what the fuck? I would expect, like, the most beautiful people. <laughs> <laughs> fucking my wife. Only the best for your wife. Only the best, because it's like, come on. But then you walk in, and then dude with that cowboy hat, and I'm just like, you? I hear you, beautiful bitch, you. What is this guy on? <laughs> he showed up at the audition doing this, and they were like, this is great. It's all going in the movie. You're hired. Oh, no. I th I, I thought she was going to refuse to do a scene with him. Oh. Uh, I mean, what? I love wearing oh. diapers. <laughs> <laughs> it would have been nice if he started off clean, clean shaven with nice slicked hair, yeah. and then he turned into what looks like a homeless meth addict. <laughs> But he starts off the film looking like that. Yeah, yeah we're, we're almost right from the beginning. His hair stick it all straight out. He looks like a lunatic. Yeah, don't start like that. No, Have even if he not. had the beard, but you'd like slick his hair back or something. Turn into that. Yeah, he yeah. should. It's no falling down, you know. It's no, <laughs> like, it's, it's just Tim Ritter's killing spree. <laughs> and I mean, his I, rationale might be if she's willing to sleep with me, yeah, he'll yeah. be willing to sleep with, with anybody. Oh, yeah. my God. <laughs> I mean, he's, yeah, he's got the physique of Mick Jagger. What the fuck? Here's the buttons. <laughs> well, yeah, we don't speedo. need to see this. It's fine. <laughs> well, it was so dirty. He looks hey, like look, Sting in Dune. Okay? How does it feel, Ben? How does it feel to dip your whip twice in one day? <laughs> what? You're a horny old bastard, aren't you? <laughs> That's, what, that's <laughs> why she had that hair. <laughs> Dude's skull was soft. <laughs> Did it kill him? All the killings are a letdown, which yes. is in a movie called Killing Spree, that's a bit of a problem. What is what is the selling point of this film? The killing spree, but it doesn't have one. But it's one. not. No. Hot buns. <laughs> Hot buns. It's the sex appeal of asbestos feet. <laughs> <laughs> For someone who's overacting as much as he is in this movie, he was like shockingly not interesting, as opposed to like again Silent Night, Deadly Night too. Like that guy is great. Drop it. <laughs> yes. Uh, but for some reason, this guy, he's hes mugging like crazy and it just doesn't work. It wants to be a comedic performance in a movie that isn't comedic. Yeah, except for granny neighbor lady. She's supposed oh, to be funny. Oh, oh Mama's yeah. Family? yeah. Yeah, Mama's Family. What is this? Why is there a mop there? It's a bloody it's mop. bloody mop. I guess he mopped up the grass. Oh. <laughs> That's when she sees he's he's trying to burn the body of the uh, delivery UPS driver. driver. Yeah. yeah. Who he drops a screwdriver. Yes. And it goes right Find the fontanelle. Or was fontanella? <laughs> fontanelle, like, yeah. Fontanelle. The fontanelle. It's like, yeah. the, this dude's baby spot never healed. <laughs> it's 
Do you know what the fontanelle is? No. It's never, never closed. The soft part of a baby's skull. Oh, okay, yeah, I, I know what that is. And that it's called a fontanelle. Fuses it, it's, it's like, it's like, yeah, it's, it's still fusing when yeah. the baby's born. So yeah. you see, a, you see a little pulse, a fontanelle pulse. Mm. I mean, it's like skull. if you see a turtle with an exposed heart. Yes, yes, oh, yes. Yeah, so, yeah. so it's a. You don't want to put your finger on the fontanelle no. and then push your finger. Yeah, because. Okay, of, okay, that's that's a great <laughs> thought to leave me with. It's Halloween. <laughs> and killing people. I won't have any of that. What are you doing with that hammer? You damn hippie. Maybe she's like totally blind. She doesn't <laughs> see him lifting a hammer up. I'm going to report it to the board. Or. Or what? I want a piece of the action. What? I want to kill some bitches too. What? <laughs> Plot twist. Not be rid of the old kook. Oh my god. The old kook wanted me to kill you. Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> What the <laughs> <fuck>? <laughs> See, babies have soft tops. Yeah. Elderly uh. have soft <laughs> bottoms. <laughs> thus, the easily hammer. Just, yeah. Just like, whoop, pull out that entire bottom jaw. Yeah, yeah he takes the cl like, claw part of the hammer. Yeah. Oh, that's right. The Turns jaw. her head into a Which rubber Halloween mask work. and a bunch of jello falls yeah. out. Yeah, it's just a SpaghettiOs. <laughs> like, uh oh, SpaghettiOs. Her soul is filled with SpaghettiOs. Chef <laughs> <laughs> Boy ID was my father. <laughs> <laughs> Is this the movie with the Tabasco blood? No, no, no that's Night of the no. Demon. That's, that, that, okay, okay. Dear God. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't even had an alcoholic beverage and you can't remember the, which film had the Tabasco blood and which one film had the SpaghettiOs. <laughs> I, I have barely five brain cells left. Is that a sentence anyone's left. ever said to you before, Rich? No, it's not. Yeah. I have like s this six, is the magic of best of the worst. six to eight blood brain cells left, and I can't. I I can remember I which have film. Six to eight blood cells. Six, six to eight blood cells left in my brain cell, <laughs> and I can remember which blood film had had uh, SpaghettiOs. <laughs> That? His friend in this his pumpkin. Friend. Goddamn depressing. Cut off a head, that's the only thing that came back. A little lot of Joss movie. The only catch, it wasn't our time. And we can't rest until you die. <laughs> 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 The only thing left to talk about with Killing yes. Spree is the ending. The magical ending where everyone comes back as zombies, which thankfully we didn't read the back of the box completely because I didn't know that was coming. So yeah, because it's like, is it fantasy? Is he picturing all this and all that stuff? But then these fuckers come back from the dead and Tiffany Amber Thiessen is like, oh, no. <laughs> yeah, she sees them. Yeah, she, everybody sees them. We, we assumed it was like a fantasy yeah. thing. Yeah. She, she went, he sent her off to her mother's house. Her, her dumb, yeah, mother. dumb mother. ass mother. I've got to do something about these bills. <laughs> <laughs> Good cut. not going to be here much. So I want you to go stay with that stupid mother of yours <laughs> so I can straighten this thing out. How much longer is that? <laughs> <laughs> I need to kill three people in one. That's all I can think about. <laughs> <laughs> this is like a nightmare. <laughs> because he needed to kill three more of her potential love affairs or whatever. And then I, I then she goes to the the paper, the newspaper. Or the magazine. magazine. Sorry, magazine. Oh, yeah. And was like, oh, I have all these filthy stories that I wrote in this little <laughs> book. Uh, well, buy your stories for 1500 bucks. Your husband never has to work a day in his life again. Because this is $1,500. $1, they're, they're rich. Yeah. You've we're hit the jackpot. Three you're in the money. We're going to buy the whole neighborhood. And then we, she sees a zombie and we're like, oh, it's not a dream. Yeah. Hey, guys. <laughs> I get the pleasure of finishing him off! <laughs> no! That's not fair! 
Well, Rich, the good news is it can't get worse today. It's, we can only Rich, go Rich up. knows better than that. I know better than that. <laughs> well, look, we get some character growth. He's given a choice at the end. The zombies say, we'll leave you alone if you kill your wife, because she's responsible for all she's this. He's trying to wrap it up. I'm and trying to get it out of this. God damn movie! Like yes, we gotta escape from killing spree and night of the demon. <laughs> oh no! Jay, Jay. It's Jay, like we're in hell. Jay, there is no escape. Oh, Jay, we've talked about killing spree for five hours. We're trapped now. in hell. We're talking five about killing hours. spree forever. Oh, no. I gotta stop drinking. <laughs> Where there's there any... been five hours. No, Tim, no, Tim, drink more, please. Okay. <laughs> Reset any... it, folks. <laughs> Yeah, oh so no! Uh, 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 but it did make it fun in the end because then we were just like, wait, 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 there's one more person. Where the fuck did. Uh, and so we. Uh, he gets so lazy by the end that he just puts one in a garbage bag and throws it behind a bed in the spare bedroom. <laughs> oh, Mike, you, you almost you almost knocked this over. Oh. It would have looked like a ghost did it. Let me fix that for what? you. What? What? I, what happened? Was there a supernatural incident? No, I didn't. I, I don't know what he's no, talking about. No, no, no. Mike, 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 Mike accidentally moved this all I, the way up to the edge, of the edge of the table. I didn't touch it. I didn't it. want people to believe that a ghost accidentally... Oh, oh my God! God! Oh, my God, it was a ghost! <laughs> Holy shit. Oh. Holy shit. Oh. <laughs> I told uh, you never to bring a Ouija the board the paranormal. The, it's floating. What the paranormal is happening. Oh, wait, you held the, it. The Ouija plank <laughs> is floating. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> it's a, t- what, what did you call it? The Ouija plank. The Ouija plank. <laughs> the Ouija <laughs> plank. It's called the planchette. Well, planchette. Why is it called a what, what does that mean? I don't it's know. A, what does a, anything mean? It's Words. a planchette. It's something that's shaped like this. <laughs> okay. It's just to point at things. It just it looks like an oversized guitar pick to me. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. <laughs> I've got to do something about these bills. Just got rocket. Oh my god, is there paranormal activity no. happening? No, no it's just, just booze. Just, oh. just booze? What? Rich, you kept looking over there very intently. I'm trying to, oh my god. The Dolly Parton. What happened? Just, Did you, you knock it over with your elbow? <laughs> no, Mike, you knocked it over. No, He's I'm adjusting my, my bike. I didn't touch uh-huh. it. <laughs> Rich is trying to talk about real paranormal activity. And you're fooling Did you around. Did something happen with our real haunted items? I'm, no, I'm actually just staring at the Sylvester Stallone Dolly Parton movie. And I, can't oh, read the name. Rhinestone. Oh. Ryan is rhinestone. Oh, that, that is a haunted item. I was thinking rhinestone. <laughs> That's why it's that there. That Frankenstein song in there? Yeah, Drinkenstein. <laughs> but why do you create a monster and they call me Frankenstein? I've taken it upon myself, everybody, to be the host of tonight's Halloween episode. Well, it's good we figured that out by the second film. Finally, somebody <laughs> taking charge. Because I didn't read the back of the box, and I'm oh, the man. curator of Red Letter Media's Haunted Museum. Night of the Demon. Um, who talked about the first one? Me? I guess yeah, you, you did. did. Yeah. I, I mean, you're taking care of everything. But, oh, like... yeah, yeah. I couldn't, you couldn't read it. I couldn't read it. <laughs> uh, so I read it for you. Who read it on the actual video? I read it, I read it on right, the actual. So then you'll, you'll take over here. Okay. So just to keep in uh, tradition. You, yeah, you might. Oh, oh put, all these. These are Jay's personal all items. All these valuable oh, slip covers. It's all fine. Right, Jay owns all these items. I own all these haunted it's, items. Well, Jay, you My own movie a collection fucking is gem right here called Night of the Demon. <laughs> Is Not to be Night confused with Night of the Demons. Yeah. Which the, is, uh, which I was you very get, why confused Why do you keep of? that, Richard? Uh-huh. uh-huh. <laughs> First off, it's about Sasquatch. <laughs> Secondly, <laughs> it's about... <laughs> what, are, what, the, is, what is it about, secondly? <laughs> <laughs> oh! oh! Dick. <laughs> oh, lift what? it up, buy it. Oh. Hot sauce. Uh, yeah, whose decision was it to use hot sauce for blood in this film? Sriracha. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> <That's fair. laughs> I didn't what want this to that? happen. Oh, it's gonna get my engine. The worst thing for Harley's is dick blood. 
Kawasaki. Kawasaki. <laughs> yeah, they ripped his Kawasaki off. <laughs> now, we wanted to see if there was any extra special footage on Killing Spree, which there was not. There, so. why didn't we not look at the fucking treasure trove of special features? Well, this, this is a There's Severn two release. two discs so. yeah. of stuff. <laughs> Dude, this. I think because we've we seen can... enough at that point. <laughs> but that's just. I don't know man. how they made one disc of content out of this movie. <laughs> I don't know how they made you one movie out of this material. Why one person is colder than everybody else. I don't know how they made one dick of content. Oh! oh! <laughs> is that yeah, all, off the all, all the special features are about how they constructed the, the no, there, prosthetic dick like that gets ripped like, off. Yeah. Eye of the Demon, the cinematographer, fraternity of horror, previously unreleased footage. Oh. And like there was a bunch of fucking crazy shit, but that did not keep us from an amazing amount of crazy shit. <laughs> Storyteller. Are, you, are you on the payroll of Night of the Demon? Like, what, what's going on here? Do you have stock in Night, Night of the Demon? If DVD I did, company? I would have said, let's watch disc two. <laughs> but did, we did you not. Have major investment in this product, <laughs> sir? I question your credibility. There We've been compromised. Luma. We've been compromised by a mole. He's trying to sell Blu-rays of Night of the Demon. I have no idea what you're talking about. Ne next thing you know, he's going to start talking about Nord VPN. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to get us another time you share. Can Do you know how you can watch YouTube without ads? <laughs> but first off. He's going to start spewing ads out. <laughs> <laughs> Great Shadow Legends. We've been infiltrated. We've been infiltrated. Compromised. <laughs> I, I bought that video Download game. And it free look slots. Like a... Look out! It's Raid Shadow Legends. I just said that. Oh, you did? Haha! <laughs> <laughs> That's my bit. I make you repeat shit. Oh yeah! Now <laughs> it's really in their brains. Raid Shadow <laughs> Legends available now on your iPhone or but, uh, it's like, like, Android I, Android it, device. <laughs> PlayStation, <laughs> whatever. I don't know, I, what, I don't is know. what is Channel it? I don't fucking know. Oh. It's some mobile game that everyone chills on YouTube. Oh, okay. <laughs> My dude! <dear. laughs> oh! That's where Jason X got the idea. <laughs> I like the POV shots. In the opening. <laughs> No blood in his body. <laughs> well, that's the weird thing. This movie is structured like almost like a like a slasher movie where it's like boring character stuff, boring character stuff. Oh my god, something yes, amazing it's happened. It's like a Friday the 13th movie. Yes, boring character stuff, boring character stuff. Okay, I'm checking out. Oh my god, a guy's dick just got ripped off. But it's, everything it's that like that structure the whole way through. Oh no. He says something when it happens where he's like, oh no, I didn't <laughs> want this to ever happen to me. <laughs> he goes, oh no, this isn't good. <laughs> <laughs> this, is bad. this is bad. Uh, <laughs> this isn't this is good. good. This is not uh, a good situation like, I'm in. Yeah. I was blessed with such a large penis. I shouldn't have flaunted it so much. I deserve this. He has, he has a commentary of his own. I mean, it's he's right. It isn't too. good. It's not a good situation if you get your dick ripped off by a Sasquatch. Oh, <laughs> I'm just going to say this. This is the hot sauce of horror films. <laughs> <laughs> And by that, so the audience knows what we're talking about, everybody in this movie's body is filled with, like, sriracha. Yeah, just, like, a, a Watered nice, down nice, hot yeah, sauce. But yeah. sometimes it's a little thick. I mean, a little... Classic sriracha or Tabasco brand sriracha when real sriracha is not in the stock? I, oh, I don't know. Whatever's, the, more, whatever's the more watery version. That's, that's Tabasco, Tabasco brand okay. sriracha. Then it's Tabasco. <laughs> Robert Ginty, no! I know exactly what he's thinking, too. That shit's getting in my fucking eye. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. It's like, oh, God. Cut, cut, it cut. Stings. Why'd you put hot sauce Let's in here? Let's go to the show. <laughs> oh, gross. Oh, God. Oh. Gross. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's nothing but hot sauce. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Straight into his brain. <laughs> Why did Bigfoot attack him like that? Because he's Bigfoot. <laughs> It goes into such a big cavity. You're not going to be able to fill nostrils. You can't roll on the camera. You, 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 keep, you keep screaming. We're going to have to film this scene again. <laughs> it's in my eyes. <laughs> 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 
Use well, this it. is the best use acting it. in the You're movies. You're dying. Yeah. <laughs> You're already dead. Don't scream now. <laughs> but it's my death gurgle. Well, <laughs> Rattle. Use hot sauce. <laughs> <laughs> so, what's the plot of the film? Plot of the film is, uh, I guess, professor slash conspiracy theorist. Is wait, like, wait, wait. Who's our, our professor? Looks like Burt Reynolds. Burt Reynolds slash uh, John C. Riley. John C. Riley. Yeah. Yeah. Burt Reynolds. John C. Reynolds. John C. Reynolds. Burt Reynolds is our college professor, and he recruits a handful of college students to go to the woods in Louisiana to hunt for the elusive Bigfoot because he shows a video? Shelly Winters and the kid from Stranger Things? I was thinking the same thing. (laughs) The exact same two people? Uh, I was thinking the Stranger Things girl. Uh, Okay. I didn't, I didn't catch on to Shelly Winters. That's totally Shelly Winters. Oh my God, and Bigfoot. Wait a minute, oh was my God. Bigfoot taking the shot and then put the camera down? <laughs> hey, can you take a picture? Oh, okay. I gotta uh, get in there before the timer goes off. <laughs> <laughs> it fell over. Seven, uh, 11 and... Oh yeah! Winters, Shelly Winters. Shelly Winters yeah. there's and 11 a, there's from a whole Stranger video Things. video footage of a camera on, and they're like, <laughs> posing for like a, video, a film, a Super 8 film, and then the camera gets knocked over and Bigfoot, you see Bigfoot. You don't see Bigfoot though, you just see like... You see a hair yarn. You see yeah. some hair, and yeah. so they say, well, that's clearly Bigfoot. And then they, and then Let's go out into the woods and investigate. All the rest of the students disperse, but five or six of them say, this is so interesting, Burt Reynolds. Let's I go. Yes, we want to go into Louisiana and investigate this. Where's Louisiana coming from? Do they say oh, that in the movie? I'm sorry, that's this movie. <laughs> that, <laughs> I'm just like, these fuckers are cold. Uh, <laughs> now I'm going to say this no, is like Northern Louisiana. California somewhere. It's the California movie, yes. Yeah, but we don't know where. But yeah, they go Bigfoot into the woods. Bigfoot wouldn't be in California unless he's in like where the Redwood Forest is in Northern California. Bigfoot but. can be anywhere, Mike. Just a little bundle of charm, isn't he? I wonder if you ever thought of showbiz. How tall is that guy? <laughs> the guy farther behind him is yeah, towering over him. That guy's got to be like 4'2". So <laughs> it would have been better if Burt Reynolds was like a complete fraud and he was teaching this class. Oh. And, he, and then he was just like, oh, you, 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 you. One he wants to sleep you, with, of course. You, yeah. You, you, yeah, probably you. Uh, I had a couple beers. Yeah, you, 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 and he brings along like forty-three girls, and they're all and, and then, and then, and then and the shortest dude. Yeah, and the shortest dude. <laughs> I'm really into Bigfoot. Okay, yeah, that's you true. Come sure. To. But we're gonna go You're look for Bigfoot, and then Burt Reynolds gets like his guts ripped out, like in the first scene, and then yeah. the rest of the characters have to survive. That, that's that the thing is there. Better. There is throughout the movie there is some story development which is that they're met with some resistance. Don't worry about Bigfoot. And they meet with Ted Turner. Ted Turner's Mm -hmm. like, oh, I'm getting some pressure on me to not let people investigate Bigfoot. And we're like, oh, what is this? This is a mystery. What's the conspiracy? What's the conspiracy? And then one night in the woods, after 57 scenes of everybody sitting around a campfire, um, they go... It was was 68 scenes. Oh, okay. Sorry, (laughs) sorry. Where they just sit around and don't do anything. Then they go off into the woods. A couple of them go off in the woods. I'm not sure why. Sex. No, not that. It's when they discover the... (laughs) I mean, that does happen too, but... Oh. Oh. This is such a gentle Bigfoot. No, the first time is they they discover some sort of weird cult uh, sacrifice thing happening. Jesus Christ. And we're like, what is this now? This is a weird twist in a Bigfoot movie. I can't believe I'm seeing why did they go to walk out and then find the immortal brain blast of crazy hermits? <laughs> <laughs> that seems I appropriate. Guess, it just looked like a bunch of rednecks. But then, yeah. but I guess a brain blast is a certain number. It's almost like a <laughs> baker's dozen. <laughs> It's a brain, brain blast. A brain blast like, is there was 32. 28, to, yeah, 28 yeah. to 32 people. Yes, brain blast. That's yeah. a brain blast. Come forth now, this man, your puppy. Through him, mighty Moloch. Then plant your seed. Oh, they got a naked little guy. Him, what? Why is he so tiny? Who is it? <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> How is he so tiny? <laughs> tiny guys. Let your seeds of hell grow deep within her. What? <laughs> What? <laughs> Just shoot them all. 
Yeah, good idea. None of your well, business, sir. Your... Oh, I was gonna fuck that chick. But they will always be scared from pistol shots. <laughs> yes. Especially if the shortest, muscly one <laughs> is naked and about to lay pipe. That is yeah, a fine. tiny, tiny man. He was trying. I thought they were doing some sort of forced perspective thing. He was so little. They got to say, I thought he was like a baby Bigfoot. Uh, I thought it was going to be a baby big Shaved. Foot. Yeah. Shaved baby well, Bigfoot. you know, the hair didn't come Wax. in yet. Yeah, maybe. maybe well, when we do finally get some good views of Bigfoot, he is completely hairless in the yeah. front. Mm -hmm. It's a very unique design for Bigfoot in this film. So they get to the second cabin, and we learn the backstory of this lady who's clearly not all together mentally. Sam Watterson. Oh, Sam, Sam Watterson. Sam Watterson. That's is her father. Sam her Watterson father. is the father of Crazy Woman, and Crazy. we get a whole flashback on the history of her and her relationship with Bigfoot. <laughs> oh. No, no, oh, didn't oh, need yeah. to see that. Yeah. Seth scratches <laughs> old face. <laughs> I hate this. <laughs> I, I just couldn't help, but I didn't want to shoot him before I finished. <laughs> yeah, why did he wait? I guess he didn't he, want to shoot because he, he was on top of it. He's a jackass. Him. Yeah, because well, that would really scar her. Well, <laughs> <laughs> because the, the crazy lady is 57 years old, but she oh, yeah. she's... <laughs> She's, she's supposed to have been impregnated when she was 15. Yeah, so we so, cut to a flashback where it's the same actress. Same with actress. Pigtails. She just has pigtails. And in modern times or current day, she has a little bit of black under her eye. Mm -hmm. What sins could I have committed that would cause you to curse my house like this? I can hear the demon devil. It's blueberry Kool Aid. Drink it. Then it's just giant, giant roll. <laughs> Yeah. It's angel food cake. <laughs> yeah, that kills devils. To combat the devil, yeah. I could have just punched her in the belly. I fed her Kool Aid. I think we need to emphasize how horrible our protagonists are. Where they just go to this woman's house, they invade her privacy, they steal her shotgun, they traumatize her. They are so <laughs> close talking. <laughs> They hypnotize her against her will twice. With a shitty ass key. They break down the door, her locked door that leads to, to the shrine of her dead baby. And these are our heroes. Oh, my baby, my baby, my baby. The true hero, the shortest of them all. Just a little bundle of charm, isn't he? <laughs> Accidentally shot himself. <laughs> 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 People he like, could have come back. He does as come a back. But as he's a, a corpse. As a corpse. <laughs> oh, with yeah, a shrimp eye. Like a oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bigfoot strings his corpse upside, is that, outside the cabin. Is that, is, that, is that an intentional, like, some sort of statement about these people, about these college characters? Oh, they, 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 are, they, are they intentionally unlikable in this movie? Or is that, like, the movie, the filmmakers are oblivious? To how like stupid th this is. Intentional or not, they are definitely unlikable, and I was actively rooting for them to die. Which is why this movie is amazing in the last ten minutes. Yes. Oh, oh my god! Oh, oh no, it's Bigfoot! Oh, he... Fuck off, Bigfoot! <laughs> That's not gonna do anything. <laughs> Smash the hell out of that you chair broke pretty easily. My chair. There's bars on the window. <laughs> yeah, this people my just shirt. Show up at this lady's house, make her relive her trauma, and then destroy all of her shit. <laughs> oh, they're the worst! Why are you pointing the camera that way? Oh no! The you dumbass. He's gonna do it. He's gonna do it. He has to smash through the front door like Jason Voorhees. Yes, he did it! Yes. Get in, get in, kill him! Hey, everybody. <laughs> what did you do to this place? You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. <laughs> I just wanted to get laid.
Oh, run! Oh, they closed okay, the door! They closed the fucking <laughs> door! Fucker! Which we talked about, it's, it's all shot in slow motion. And it has this weird droning score. Yeah, it's not like like stupid looking schlock, but uh, but yeah, the the weird execution of the ending is like kind of unintentionally like artsy and surreal. Pull out his yes. Yes. Oh, yes. oh my God! Oh he's my God. The <laughs> oh. 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 Those are good guts. Those are probably real guts. Yes. <laughs> Get out of there! No! <laughs> no, not this time, bitch! How are you gonna die? Help me, Lord! Oh, you wanted to, all you needed to do was accept me into the throuple. Right. <laughs> but no! In the oh! Summer. Yes! Oh! Dang! <laughs> What happened to Tom Selleck? He just died? Um... I don't remember him getting killed. No. No. Oh, there he is. Just he was there. just sleeping. He was just sleeping. Just, 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 That's bizarre. Because if you're actually paying attention to the scene, Burt Reynolds, he's just like sleeping in a chair in the background. We're like, is he dead? Did he get killed off camera? But then no, because we got to a close of him and then he gets up and tries to escape. I think he was playing possum and oh. letting I think he was playing possum and letting Bigfoot slaughter his friends. <laughs> and then he was planning to slip out on notice. This is but working it didn't great. Work out. And that's the thing though, like we liked it because all these characters are unlikable. Was it supposed to be a sad, tragic ending that all these characters got killed? I don't I mean, know. The short dude shouldn't have been killed. That's like just that's that's faulty gunmanship. <laughs> I give Night of the Demon a thumb sideways. <laughs> I give Night of the Demon a thumb. <laughs> I give it one can of SpaghettiOs. <laughs> uh, splattered on a tree. Two bottles of hot sauce. Yeah. <laughs> no, Lula. this is this is what you want in a movie like this, though, where there is kind of an escalation. Because there are boring parts, but it is like those those moments early on will jolt you awake, and then you have an amazing ending. Oh, no, no it was, we're yeah, 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 it's ninety nine percent an, boring. It's an escalation. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah. Ah, there's spikes throughout the whole movie. The history of humanity until the invention of the computer. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Look at that smooth escalation. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's fucking crazy. He's, he's trying to justify his pick. Yeah, I know. I thought it was yeah, okay. You did, okay. You, did, you did okay. I thought it was an okay you movie. Got, you got lucky in the last five minutes, Jay. <laughs> hey, that's better than some movies. It would have been two minutes if it weren't for the slow-mo. <laughs> <laughs> Camping, 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 was the was the uh, sleeping bag before Dick? It was. It was before. It was. Yeah. So the sleeping, sleeping bag, bag was early on. Yeah. Dick. The, the sleeping bag. Okay. Sleeping yeah. bag. Dick. So, so don't forget the sleeping bag. In Jay's bag. defense, if I saw the sleeping bag, that's yes. why I picked the movie. And then I'd be like, oh, that is okay. the moment I picked the movie. Fling it around, go around a guy in a sleeping bag. I'm in. Yeah. You've got me. <laughs> Music just got bored. <laughs> <laughs> Is anybody listening? Oh, fuck this. No, I'm out of here. Whiskey with a Y uh, is is like Scottish only, and then whisk, whiskey with the E Y is is everywhere else. There's 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 specifics with that too, but uh, bourbon is specifically Kentucky, like like Jack Daniels is. Bourbon. I'm having Whiskey more bourbon. fun talking about this than the last one. Yeah, I know, I know, shit. I know. Uh, there's okay, a lot, cool, there's cool, a lot of the vampire cool. writers. Because white label? <laughs> blue. Oh. Label. Not, what? Is it blue or green that's the top shelf? It has to Johnny. be green because I haven't even heard of that shit. 
Yeah, it must be green. Black is not the top. I think it's, no, it's not. I don't black think label is not the top. Red green, is above black. Green, Mike, blue is the, the top. Bottom, Mike, did you stand white? up the copy of Vampire no. Writers? Blue. What? Did that just stand up on itself? Oh my! Oh my <laughs> God! Hot damn! The DVD Here we stand. are arguing over the seniority of Johnny Walker labels and uh, our our DVD copy of Vampire Riders has stand up all on its <laughs> just own. Just on its own. I, I just did it. It it's, was. It felt perhaps neglected. it needs to go with the real haunted items category, of which we have been monitoring. Yeah, with, yeah. With a night vision X cam. I'm for sure any, there's been some sort of activity we'll, while we've been discussing we'll, it. Right? We'll find out later. If, yeah. the, if maybe you that, see that, like, that that teddy bear's eyes just went like. <laughs> oh, oh. I, see, I will freak the fuck out. Tell Funny, when we had me. a breeze in here, I think the rosary started swinging a little bit. Oh, oh. Ooh. Anyways, Rich. Yeah. Tell us all about <laughs> Vampire Riders. You must keep yourself nourished, as this is the greatest night in five centuries. Trust me, it's not. Okay, Vampire Riders. Um, you know, compared to everything else we watched today, paced quite well. Considering I still don't really know exactly all what happened in this. Yeah. yeah. Um, there are some vampires, and they're your typical annoying, gothy vampires who are just obnoxious. And then you got a couple of vampire hunters who really are very good at throwing stakes. Usually, usually you'd have to like pound a stake, but they just yeah. throw stakes uh. like fucking lawn darts and kill vampires. Could they have been weighted stakes? You know, I'm sure there's an expanded universe novel that goes into all of the details about <laughs> their gear, but we don't get any of that information. We just get a bus full of assholes <laughs> <laughs> and Marina Sirtis. <laughs> That gets chased by some vampires on motorcycles, and then the bus stops at a junkyard that's having a rave, and apparently it's New Year's Eve. Yeah, yeah. And then the movie just kind of ends. <laughs> Found and sacrificed every car. <laughs> the general idea of the film is bald guy. Was he bald? Bedman. Bed, Bed Bedman vampire. Bed Bedman or Batman? Who sucks blood all the time, which powers vampires. I think, I think yeah. he's dying in vampire terms. And he needs a daywalker, which is a vampire who is half human, half vampire, like a blade, yeah. who, who, who is not truly a human or truly a vampire, somewhere in the middle. And they know it's a girl, so they, they, his vampire henchmen keep bringing him ladies. And he, he bites on him, sucks their blood, and says, ah, oh, that's fine, but it's not, not the daywalker. Uh, I'm laying in this bed <laughs> in my lofty apartment with plastic. With, with, yeah, plastic uh, paint drop claws. <laughs> yes. And then he makes women just stand behind him in like awkward poses, and they just have to stand there. And he has no shoes or socks on, and he's just like, but Marina Sirtuds. Maybe in the opening, we're not sure, had sex with a vampire, and she's a human, and the vampire, and they had a baby, which is the girl on the cover, whatever her name is. And she's the day Oh, her name is uh, I'm Lala. I'm Lala. Hmm? It's actually a Lala. A-L-A-L-A. It's the name of a word goddess. A la la la. A la la la. Yeah, that's a terrible name, lady. La la la. Which is short for a la 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 Somewhat famous actress, Amanda. I mean, she's been in stuff. She's on like Westworld, right? Yeah. Can you say Westworld? Yeah. So okay, so we have a we have a cast, an all star cast. We have the guy who played Bernie and Bernie. <laughs> Bur weekend at Bernie's. Bernie. And, 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 and Bernie. Weekend at Bernie's too. And weekend at Bernie's Give too. Give him his credit. Uh, we have Sticky Fingers, the rapper who plays the lead vampire. Bring me the daywalker. We have Smalls, who plays Small vampire, vampire hunter, hunter. who. I don't know who Smalls is. That's his a, that's name, a who's name, affiliated though. His with name anyway. suggests like something famous, like a like a rapper, yeah, actor, yeah. model. I'll or something. look it up. Look but at something Smalls. No, just no, it's just Smalls. Just Smalls. Yeah, just Smalls. Uh, then we have Marina Sirtis, aka Counselor Troy from Star Trek: The Next Generation. Oh, wait, this is the hardest movie to look up 
uh, characters because if you try to look it up, there's only five. But there's oh, like at least IMDb, 15. Yeah. They've all said nope. <laughs> like, please do not. Well, that's the weird thing. Yeah, there's like somewhat well-known people, but the like production level is all over the place where it's like some, like it's shot on decent cameras, but like some lighting looks pretty nice and then others looks like horrible. Uh, the, the real like deficit comes in the sound. More sound effects. That needs a not, not just dead silence. Yes. Especially the very beginning. And it's like this weird like quiet. Oh when yeah. When it should have been a like, like tons, 25 layers of sound effects and right. music and all that. But, and then the, the score, especially at the end at the rave. Mm -hmm. the well, any, all the music, all the, like the, the songs yeah. are terrible. Songs, music, so, uh, sound effects, uh, tone, ambience, like all that, it's just terrible. <laughs> oh, they stopped at a rave. Why did this, why did the bus stop at a rave? Because it had to get more gas. Because now you have a whole bunch of people that the vampires can kill. It's a very happy rave. Ugh. This is like, this music makes me want to dance. This movie needs like Marilyn Manson. I know. And like metal. Why is there no rap music in this movie? Yeah. I think Sticky Finger Fingers could have provided some music. And I called him Sticky Fingers. Stinky Fingers. It's fingers. Probably, it's probably not what he intended his name to be. Stinky Fingers. Stinky, Stinky Fingers. fingers. <laughs> Sticky Fingers of Onyx is, has a beef with Rich Evans. <laughs> Stinky Fingers. I can't wait for the diss track. The last thing it's you... It's going to be the easiest fucking rap song Onyx. he ever wrote. Onyx comes <laughs> back <laughs> out of obscurity. <laughs> To fucking diss Rich Evans? <laughs> Eight minutes of pure destruction. It's the longest <laughs> rap song ever written. <laughs> Talking at it for four hours and 37 minutes. Against somebody who is just trying to make a joke. I started writing it, it just kept coming. I, I couldn't stop. <laughs> They can't touch Bibles? Well, they're vampires. Well, it's crosses, not Bibles. The Bibles yeah. and covers Bibles just a uh, Bible. turpentine. Or Every vampire movie has their own lore. This movie's lore is that this guy's going to sit in the bed the whole movie. So, Marina Sertes. She's in the movie. And she has her daughter, Amanda. I, want now, to, I keep wanting to say Amanda is, Safely. She's Troy, right? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Also, Constable Troy in Star Trek Picard season three. There, right. Could I just watch the final season of Picard? Yes, yes. you absolutely yes. Absolutely. Just be like, in fact, that's recommended. One hundred percent recommended. <laughs> now, now she, uh, 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 Marina Sirtis. Yeah. She shows up in season one of Picard too, though, right? Yes. Yes. So I need to see it. Well, you don't need to. Uh, but I'm just wondering, like, when the cast got back together to, to do that, do you think they're like, so what have you guys been up to? And then she's like, oh. I was in a movie with sticky fingers. I was in a movie with sticky fingers. Look, Jay, they've all done horrible things for money, okay? That's true, that's true. The best one is probably uh, Patrick Stewart. Well, the, yeah, like you, uh, I think Tim said, this is a movie where Bernie, Bernie Sertovs, everyone, and, and who has a SAG card, was in this before the end of the year. <laughs> To renew their SAG. Oh, that was you. That was me. To re uh, renew yeah. their SAG insurance. <laughs> and, and it's like, okay, yes, yes, we'll pay you 500 bucks to be in this movie. It's what, Marina Sirtis was probably on set for what, three days, two days? She, she's got a pretty big part in it. Yeah, but how many locations did they really film in? They probably knocked that four, out. Four quick. or five days, gave her a thousand bucks, and she got to renew her SAG card. <laughs> For, for the year. Got and to do a little acting. There's one scene between said, her and Bernie. I want one scene yeah. where I cry. Sometimes the decisions you make, even the small ones, have repercussions you could never imagine. May the Lord be with us. Beam me up, Scotty. <laughs> Joy to Enterprise, beam me up. <laughs> Bye, bitches. <laughs> <laughs> Straight. Set back in time Watch to stop sticky mean. fingers <laughs> from starting this movie. <laughs> Just trying to save the timeline. Yes, the movie timeline. 
Jay, we had to save cinema. <laughs> <laughs> this movie can't be finished. <laughs> Bernie, it's even, going to even be Bernie's good. too good for this. <laughs> He, he his emotional scene in this. I think he was crying more though for she, she, off camera reasons yeah, yeah, she, when he she, realized that he was in <laughs> <laughs> Vampire Riders. Well, seriously though, uh, I I, serious? I don't know much about him. I don't. Uh, he's Other, in a he's in a Friday the Thirteenth movie. Okay, but uh, he's not like a fucking Marlon Brando. No, no. Where he's in uh, Vampire <laughs> Riders. Hey, so you okay. try to act like you're completely weightless. But what I'm being saying carried is, by like a fucking couple of yachts. He shouldn't be crying. He's in Vampire Riders. He should be crying from happy happiness, happy tears. <laughs> that because this, he's getting a thousand bucks. Vamp- Vampire Riders is keeping yeah. his house the, off escrow. Yes, yes, you're, you're misinterpreting it. Oh, it's okay, sad. okay. It's happy now. Those are happy tears. Yes, so, I can pay right. for my prescription drugs. Okay. <laughs> can pay for, so can what you're saying is this movie's Lipitor. like a Rorschach test of emotions. Yes, oh. yes, exactly. What is this actor thinking during this scene? Please. Oh, Bernie, you're really trying. I wish I was dead again. <laughs> What's her name? Beanie Hat is the daywalker, right? Yes. Beanie Hat's the daywalker, yeah. and she plays with knives. Yes. Thus, Blade. Hello. Okay, so now I'm really scared. Am I the only one that just saw it wake up? Look, when you kill a vampire, you have to drive a stake through its heart. That, or if you're going to use a knife, you gotta cut his head clear off. So how do you kill something that's already dead? He just explained he just, it! Yeah, explained. <laughs> they, they're just like, they, it's like, if we call her a daywalker, then people are gonna say blade, so let her play with knives, okay? And then, then it's a good brush on. To, it's a subtle he... homage to blade. Oh, oh my gosh. Yeah. Homage. Okay. Homage. Okay, homage. Oh, boy, that cheesy. demon's really taking his time pushing that thing forward. I know, I know. <laughs> <laughs> what demon? What are you talking about? Oh, the ghost, the spooky ghost. It was really taking his time. The, all the time, I keep thinking he has a picture of C-3PO on his shirt. <laughs> that's that's, what, uh, this? that's C-3PO's corpse. Okay, underneath yeah. the... C-3PO yeah. has bones? I mean, that's what like the C, C stands that's for. That's corpse yeah. 3PO. <laughs> Rich agrees with me. I agree with Mike. He's wondering why you have a skull and crossbones picture with C-3PO on it. That's not a C-3PO. But I imagine if C-3PO had a skeleton, it would look just like that. (laughs) I can see through P.O. (laughs) (laughs) So you going to knock that over anytime soon, or...? I'm not doing nothing. (laughs) You've been pushing it forward for the last 15 minutes. The clown just moved. Look, Jay. The clown, oh my, moved. the clown moved. The clown what? Moved? Are you kidding me? What? <laughs> Rich, Rich is the culprit. <laughs> He's moving the box. Anyway, back to He's vampire He's just like riders. a ninja. <laughs> he tried to distract you by making him look at the clown. What about the clown? It just looked. What's happening with the clown? Rich, what? Rich is moving the box next to me. Should I still be looking, looking at the, the clown? Continue to look at the clown. I'm for looking. The rest I'm of waiting for something to happen with the clown. Anyways. <laughs> well, uh, I think our, our hero. Oh, 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 oh my god! god. Oh, oh my god! god. This I'm is sorry if I scream too loud. It's we'll, fine. Oh. Will Will Rich die tonight? Oh my god! It's a, oh, 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 Take too long. Wait, that's what oh. you get. That's our main bad guy. Dude, no, our main now. bad guy is sleeping on a bed, and she's gonna show oh, up. Oh, that guy. Yeah, I forgot about him. Oh, daylight. The main bad guy has to show up. I forgot about that guy. There he, there is. he is. It was just the naked lady. It's a slum. She's and they're just lang- hanging around. Are they dead? The hunters and the daywalker defeated Wade. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh. Oh. He died. Oh, is the movie over? Yeah, I think so. 
The movie's just over? He didn't make it. He, that he, just happens what if like he that? Shows up he here? didn't get the Daywalker blood in time, Rich. <laughs> just did. Our heroes did it. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Yay! You can just end a movie like this? Yeah. <laughs> they went through a hard-fought battle that lasted 30 seconds. Uh, Smalls kills... Fucking sticky, I thought, or does I brother thought, of Smalls kill sticky? I thought lady threw thing at sticky. <laughs> lady threw thing at sticky. Lady threw thing at who sticky. Threw thing at who threw thing at who? Little little sticky threw thing. Lady, <laughs> big come out. Lady walk <laughs> big sticky. Lady walk away with man. Awkward frame shot. Yes. Sticky finger walk, get up and walk on train tracks. Oh yeah, 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 walk yeah, yeah. on train tracks to love. the worst song sticky ever recorded. Sticky eye to camera go. <laughs> Sunrise ending, film done. All of your ways I've been looking. All of your days Ooh. I've been looking for Oh, it hurts this. Oh. Uh. Oh. Yeah. This is the director's music. <laughs> <laughs> We've reached 80 minutes. We can sell this to Blockbuster Video. Let's fucking get out of here. <laughs> and he'll be back in Vampire Riders 2. We're still waiting. We're still waiting. Get it to us quickly. It's going to, uh, yeah. Coming November 2038. Yeah. <laughs> when Marita Certes' SAG card is expiring. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Is there any word about Vampire Viders 2 yet? I, I, I need another grand <laughs> for 17 weeks. I need my work. blood pressure medicine. I just need to get through the month. <laughs> Oh, Holy shit! Oh Oops. my god, it's just it's just floating by itself. This is such a haunted item. It still has the, the, the Rich, thrift why, store it's a price spice tag cabinet? on it. Why That's would you think this is? was haunted? Because the paint's chipped off of it. Why? <laughs> That's literally the only reason I bought it. It looks vaguely old. But why? But why would something old be haunted? The, why would something new be haunted? Because this is all bullshit for the camera, but and no, something that looks what, old is something an audience person would think. But why would you have haunted. these preconceived notions? That's what I'm asking. People always think old shit is creepy oh. and haunted Who and run down. You, you, <laughs> Zach Baggins. Specifically, just you. Yeah. <laughs> you. I think the bear did move. <laughs> We're here to talk about which film is. The best of the worst. That's not what the sign says. Oh, no, it's not. It says Haunted Museum. But um, uh, we, have, we have three films tonight. Uh, Killing Spree by Tim Ritter. Night of the Demon by someone. And Vampire Riders. By no one. By no one starring... Uh, some people. Sticky fingers. <laughs> yeah. Sticky fingers. We, no one could ever forget Sticky Fingers and Marina Sertes together at last <laughs> in Vampire Riders. Um, we, we, we will ask the Ouija board, I'm sorry, the spirit board, uh, <laughs> what is the best of the worst, but... We'll save we, that for last. We'll save that for last, yeah. whether or not, uh, and it'll have to spell it out. So it's probably oh going to be, oh God. Everything They all have long titles. It's, it's, got a a fucking, it's got a fucking arrow on it. It could just point oh, at the right. one. No, yeah, yeah. Oh, right. oh, we have I to see. turn yeah, the yeah. board. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 But, but, but that's last. We have to go but without the spirit board first. We have to talk about who, uh, oh. Oh, God. Uh, oh, this is a it's tough pretty, decision. Jay, you're the tough. most lucid. <laughs> and, and Rich is... I'm the one who has a drink. Rich, Rich is a, Jay. Yes. Killing Spree, Night of the Demons, or Vampire Riders for the 2023 Halloween Best of the Worst. What is the Best of the Worst? Uh, my pick for Best of the Worst is Night of the Demon. <laughs> You know what? It's <laughs> start contemplating. <laughs> what is wrong with him? I'm gonna say, you know what? It was shot on film. It had a couple little highlights, and uh, the ending made the whole movie worthwhile. Let's, oh. let's see what that guy thinks. I don't know about him. It, is, it could go anyway. I'm yeah, not yeah, sure if yeah. he's in a frame of mind. I don't know. Something. I want to say killing spree. 
because oh, Tim, um, killing spree. Tim killing Ritter's spree. killing spree. Tim Ritter's killing spree because <laughs> fuck that. My, why? But, but why? Why? The, but for why? Yeah, why? Just how the guy went over the top to show his madness, and then uh, his madness actually being uh, real. I think ba- Vampire Riders is the best of the worst. And I'm so sorry that you have to be the tiebreaker, but I took over and I'm sorry. Oh, 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 no, no, because you know what I'm going with? I'm going with Rhinestone. <laughs> no! Whoa! And Dolly Parton. You can't, you can't. The, 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 you, know, you know what the tiebreaker's going to be? The most haunted gonna be? movie of all. The tiebreaker's going to be the fucking Ouija board. I mean, the spirit the board. The spirit board. Spirit board, Can I say what? what why, is, why is Vampires? Vampire Riders. Okay, the other movies had their kind of fun moments. Vampire Riders, while there weren't any specific, like, like this, I would say, like the guy throwing the, the decapitated head down. And this, like, uh, the... Uh, the I, dick ripping. Oh, no! The dick the ripping, dick yeah. There, there are highlights. But this... There are no highlights. There are no highlights. The one or two strong highlights that were exhibited in Killing Spree or Night of the Demon were very, like, very evenly spread out throughout Vampire Riders to where we turned it on and we're just like, oh, this is a movie. There, there are, I think, I think there's a case, I think there's a case to be made for everyone. You, you want my honest Thank opinion? Thank you, Rich. Thank you. Yes. I think Killing, Killing Spree, there's some oddness there. It's, it's oh, yeah. cheaply produced. The acting is, is, is terrible, which is almost interesting in itself. Uh, you get Demon Knight. You have just the last, <laughs> the last redeeming. Night of the Demon. Head of the, I don't even give a shit. <laughs> Night of the Demon, where the last five minutes just kind of redeems everything. So yeah. kind of, mm. You know, last five minutes are really interesting, but everything before just garbage. <laughs> and then you got Vampire Riders, which I'm gonna say is somewhat entertaining, almost, almost, but not quite a real movie. Mm. <laughs> There's no, an argument. Have to try to use the phaser on some vampires. <laughs> that would have put it over the top. <laughs> it's like the whole thing is secretly a TNG episode would have been amazing. Yeah, I, I suggested it. Yeah, yeah. Who's trying to save, save cinema history by stopping the creation? Of, no, by allowing Sticky Fingers to produce his next album, which saved humanity. Yeah, like, the, like, the, back, like, the Bill and Ted plot. Yeah. The va- vampire attacks. Counselor Troy, and then Riker beams out at the last minute to step in and save her. <laughs> data, 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 like, data, like chimes in. Uh, Commander, I figured out that if you set the fre- frequency of the phasers to approximate sunlight, it should destroy the creatures. Hey, Amen, sticky fingers. What is that supposed to mean? <laughs> if vampire writers had a scene between. Sir Patrick Stewart mm. and Sticky Fingers, <laughs> then I would have enjoyed okay. it a lot more. This is what I love about my friend Rich Evans. <laughs> it's that I'm so super drunk and he's not, but we still uh, vibe. <laughs> I'd say stupid jokes. We can still laugh about Star Trek jokes. <laughs> and, uh, and he's not even drunk, but I am. Um, <laughs> Shoot Sticky Fingers. <laughs> Right in the dick. I think I'm brain damaged in such a way that I'm always slightly drunk. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. sure. Okay. Yeah. I don't think I believe in anything anymore. Whichever one of us has the better well, no, arm no, strength. We'll do, we'll do this. We'll put it there. <laughs> so whichever be, one it points at. Don't be cynical. Just, just two fingers. Oh, yeah, and just two fingers. In the magic. Nose. Don't use your cynical fingers. Yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No pushing hard. Just, oh, spirits of the beyond. Including demons, which may or may not possess Rich Evans after he drops Tim Higgins off at his home safely. What is the best of the Thanks, worst? guys. Best of the All worst right. is... Oh, oh God, it's so my God. God. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, it's killing spree. Ghosts are real. Ghosts are real. Zach Baggins was right the whole time. Tim Fritter's killing spree. Only an evil entity would have picked killing spree. Oh, oh my God. Only people with mental problems would have been killing spree. Tim Fritter's killing spree. Help us, Lord. Help us, Jesus. There is no God. Only Satan. Only, Satan. Only Tim Ritter. Only Tim, Tim Ritter is killing spree. Tim Ritter is the best of the worst. 
To me, teddy bear. Hunted teddy bear. Who's in there? Why don't you hunt this teddy bear? You can speak through this portal. Talk to us through the portal. Talk to us. Why does you want this clown?